week long once we saw the brackets released here it is herbert santos against kainan duarte kainan duarte is on a roll this season and oh, look at that coming quick. a little aggressive pulling guard right away now these two have trained together i believe when herbert had a, a small stint at atos hq a few years back so you know, I, I believe that the, there's enough people at Atos that may have given Kynan some tips on how to defeat Herberth, but feeling Herberth's uh, monstrosity is another issue altogether. Herbert sitting back and Kynan using the opportunity to transition, inverting here. He's got to be careful in this position. Herbert studying Kynan's movement. Stop, stop, stop. Kynan nearly hitting that tripod sweep off of De La Hiva. That was nice. Now I'm not sure. It looks like maybe he's going over for this knee bar, but uh, man, that is that's a bit risky against yeah. somebody like Herberth. Sitting back up on a single now. Herberth shucking the leg up and over. Oh, and Herberth explosive, sprawling his legs back. And the this ref is <laughs> really getting involved in this yeah. one. Which is unfortunate. It's a shame that it's <laughs> happening at the edge of the mat there because uh, the momentum was starting to build there. Here we go. Action restarted. Herbert Santos on top. Kane Duarte picking that leg, that pant grip there, trying to circle his leg in for single leg X position. Weaves his right leg in. Herbert trying to peel Kynan's right sleeve grip off his pant. Interesting uh, position for Kynan here. And I think he's doing this to shut down the knee bar attempts from Herbert. But in the meantime, setting up a single leg X. He's got to worry about getting that yeah. leg off into the 50-50 side. Yeah, because if this is not what he wants, because as Herbert is smashing those legs together, this is a good passing position for Herbert. But Kynan works it. The, the thing with Kynan, from what I've been hearing from a lot of the training partners, is he's got grips of iron. So sometimes where you see him looking like it's a bad position, watch where his grips are. If he has his hands gripped on Herbert's leg, it looks bad to us, but he has something up his sleeve. He's, he knows that he's not in danger because he's maintaining those grips. Whereas other people, we might tell them, you know, release the grip. Be concerned. You have Herbert Santos on your back. Kynan's got something going. He's got something cooking for sure. Well, he's having a hard time with this grip that Herbert is making with Herbert's right arm. Right now, he's trying to circle that arm out and clear the grip, but Herbert is not letting go of this hand. No. I think Herbert knows that once he transfers it. Oh, he's just moving there moving it is. to 50-50. To Herbert's the back gonna, now. Yeah, trying for that knee bar. Oh, such a smart takedown attempt by Kynan. He's got to watch. Uh, Herbert's got some great. And there it is. Beautiful single to double. Cuts the knee out from behind to get on top. Kynan doing such a smart job of dismantling Herbert Santos in this match. Three minutes, 10 seconds left to go. This is not where Herbert Santos wants to be. Herbert is not really known for having an amazing close guard or any kind of guard. What we'll probably see here is Herbert scramble out of frustration to get back on his feet and get into his, his elements. This is where Kynan needs to keep control Keep the pace and do not give er Herbert uh, an inch here. You see Herbert almost kicking kind in a way, trying to make space there. He wants out of this position at all costs. Kind of with some slick passing, so I can't argue that with Herbert. He's got to be careful. If Herbert retracts his leg to establish some foot base so he can stand, Kynan's going to capitalize, so it's really tricky. Look for Herbert to to shoot this triangle aggressively from Lasso if he can break off the grip from yeah, his it's, leg. It's, it's not his jam, though, John Evans. He's not known for a finisher from the bottom. I think with Kynan, he's got to be very careful. I don't know if he's going to do that. He's got to be careful. It's there. Is Herbert ever careful? <laughs> there it is, Kynan. 
You see Kynan slowly dealing with that lasso hook. Just bringing his weight back down, using his, arm, his elbow to kind of inch it back inwards. Keeping good distance management going here with his feet. Herbert has a nice little move from lasso. He'll underhook the leg with the same lasso leg. And then that's one of his sweeps. And I think Kynan knows that. That's why you're seeing Kynan being very intricate with his footwork while defending those lasso hooks. So there it is. Herbert tried to get a sweep real quick. And that moment, Kynan tries to blast by Herbert, trying to get to his feet constantly. Kynan shutting him down at all costs. Switching grips now. One minute to go. This is a close one. That one grip on the leg that Kynan has, just keeping Herbert on his back. I thought for sure Herbert would be able to scramble up to the feet in that little exchange, but Kynan keeping Herbert right where he wants him. Herbert's really got to go for broke here. Yeah, he has to do something. 30 seconds left. And yeah, he's he gonna, to he's going to close guard. He's going to try to attack arms if he can. He's probably going to get frustrated. Look, you're going to see, see it in his face. This is the one cri criticism of Herbert Santos. When he gets in deep water, he gets frustrated and gives up. And you can see it happening now. He's starting to mentally break. Kynan is breaking him down methodically, technically. And Herbert's there is that. Going. He's still that was That's where he likes to be, Herbert. See how he hooks the opposite leg? That's the sweep I was telling you about earlier. And Kynan drags him out of bounds. Can't imagine that that wasn't uh, something that was a tactical choice. You know, what's impressing me about Kynan Duarte is, although he's a new black belt, although he's young, I believe he's only 23 years old, he's showing a level of mat IQ. It looks as though he's been competing for 10 years at black belt. He's so precise in his technique. And that I think that comes from, you know, training in one of the best academies, if not the best academy in the world, Atos HQ in San Diego. Now Herbert Santos trying to get that last second attempt, but too little too late. Kainan Duarte wins in this showdown with the bad boy, Herbert Santos. And I think that this is a foreshadowing of what's to come with Kainan Duarte. This is a semifinal match, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, it is. Semifinal, 94 kilo division matchup. Kainan Duarte is now in the finals for the first time ever at the black belt division of the Abu Dhabi World Pro. Wow. Amazing job by Kainan Duarte. And I believe he's going to face the winner of Wardzinski. Wardzinski and Basel Famous. And I think it's safe to say Wardzinski is the favorite of the match. Let's take a look at the replay. Look at his right hand. Boom. Cuts the left knee out of Arbor Santos from that single leg. Smart strategy. Walking backwards and then pop. Cutting that knee out to take him down. Beautiful technique by Kainan Duarte. Shades of Andre Galvan. Look at there it is again. Using like that right hand. Bam. Gets him to the mat. With that left hand under the leg, controlling the collar, turning the corner, boom. There it is. That was the only score in the match. Uh, but a lot happened. A lot happened. Uh, Kainan Duarte showing some maturity and, you know, not <laughs> getting too emotional with this loss. Congratulating his uh, fellow Brazilian compatriot. But tomorrow, Kainan Duarte will be in the finals, set to face the winner of this next matchup showdown between Adam Wardzinski 